the state of Idaho hosts only two Division I football programs, the University of Idaho Vandals and the Boise State Broncos, two teams competing as an in-state rivals since their first meeting in 1971. In 71, the Broncos were able to take that first game, but since then, the teams have traded off winning streaks, with Idaho currently holding the longest streak of 12 games. However, the Broncos are currently in their longest streak with 11 consecutive wins since 1999. The Broncos and the Vandals compete every year for the Governor's Trophy, a traveling trophy that has remained in the hands of the Broncos since 2001. You know, Boise has that streak right now like Idaho did, so I still call it a big rivalry. I wish it would continue. That's not up to me. I think it has to continue for the state. It's crazy not to play each other home and home. Longtime fans agree, regardless of the national rankings, this game needs to continue to be played. And, uh, it's always been a good rivalry. Uh, it's gotten less competitive, I guess, over the years, but I, I think the state needs a rivalry and they, they should do it. Well, I think it's good, and I said that from the get-go. Uh, you know, I, I really think it's a great tradition in Idaho. Uh, I'd like to see it continue. Longtime Vandal fan and UI grad Judy Morris says once you're a Vandal, you're always a Vandal. And no matter where you end up after you graduate, you hold true to the colors of your alma mater. Judy's husband and voice of the Vandals, Tom Morris, agrees. Either you're a Bronco or a Vandal. And I've known some families that the mom's a Bronco, the dad's a Vandal. They'll come walking with their orange and blue and black and gold into the dome or into Bronco Stadium. And... You know, they're still married, but they're a Bronco and a Vandal. History is in the making as Boise State and University of Idaho face off in what looks like one final battle. The question is, who will walk away with the Governor's Trophy? And will Idaho hold on to the longest consecutive win streak? We'll find out Friday in the Dome. For Inside the Vandals, this is Lisa Short and Jimmy Dawson.